Greetings and welcome to the Mindfully Well Center. Today we come to you with the Mindfully Well Center Insomnia Program. This portion of our program covers the progressive muscle relaxation. This is an exercise that you do prior to bedtime. Now some of you have various different times that you go to bed. So you may use it at your predetermined uh, bed prep time that is in your daily schedule. So let us begin with the instructions. We'll start with walking through different muscle groups of your body. We'll have the feet as one of the muscle groups, the what I call the, the butt, and I'll explain what that is. That's basically the thighs and the um, buttocks. The belly is the abdomen area. The hands, at that point, will bring the hands up and they'll be in this position with a slight, slight bend in them. We'll be tightening and relaxing. We'll have the shoulders, and the shoulders will be going straight up as if your shoulder blades could reach your earlobes, which we know they can't. Then the neck, and we'll have a little prep for the neck before we actually do the exercise, and then we'll end with the face. Remembering throughout this exercise that we are not clenching. We are not clenching the teeth or the jaw. So at some point I might direct you to take a yawn as a way of releasing your jaw. So let us begin, and we'll move over to our subject here tonight. Find a comfortable position, either in a recliner or in your bed, as it was prescribed in your program. And you want to make sure that the head has a good rest, the shoulders are properly positioned, and the, the feet are elevated. So we'll begin. You can close your eyes. And bring your attention now to your breath. You can place one hand on the abdomen and one hand on your chest. Go ahead and close your eyes and listen to my voice. If you are confused about the instructions, you can open your eyes and look at your screen. Otherwise, allow my voice to guide you through a progressive relaxation. Bring in the attention to the belly. Notice the rise and the fall of the abdomen as you breathe in and out. Really bringing that attention to the belly. You're blowing the belly up like a balloon full of air. Pausing and then slowly releasing. Now move that breath to the upper chest. So we'll begin the breath at the belly. The first part of the breath coming in. The second part of the breath, bring it up to the chest and a nice deep inhalation. Pausing and slowly releasing, just the reverse. Releasing the chest, releasing the belly, bringing that belly button as if it's going to touch the back of your spine or your spinal column, which we know it can't. This is just for your imagination. Now continue that breath. Belly, chest, hold, and release. Continue on your own. Allowing the breath to come back to normal rhythm. Shifting our attention to our feet. Bringing the attention all the way back to the feet now. The feet do a lot of work all day long. So we're going to just gently make circles with our ankles and release some of that tension that you've been carrying in those feet all day long. And 
and come back to center. The procedure that we'll do now, we'll do for each one, each of the muscle groups. This is a muscle group now that's focused on the feet and the calves, so below the knees. We'll start with a complete exhalation. Exhale all the way out. Inhale. And point the toes toward your nose. Hold. Two, three, four, and relax. Relax and let go. Relax and let go. This is the procedure we'll use for each of our muscle groups. We'll repeat, these a repeat this a second time. Exhale. Inhale. And tighten. Hold. Two. Three, four, and relax. Relax and let go. And let's give it some time to feel the relaxation response. Some people report a little tingling when this happens. That is not a nervous system disorder. It's actually a healthy sign that you're increasing the circulation to this area of your feet. We now move up to the area that we call butt, and that is the buttocks and the thighs. So from the knees up to the waist, to the buttocks area is what we're focused on now. And as before, we'll go through the same steps. Exhale, inhale, and hold. Two, three, four, and release and relax. When we do this release, it's a quick release so that we can feel the difference between very, very, very tight and very relaxed. Throughout this exercise, we're retraining our brain to know the difference between being uptight and stressed and moving into a state of deep relaxation. Repeat this procedure. Exhale. Inhale. And hold. Two, three, four. And relax. Relax and let go. allowing our body time to register what that feels like to have that release and giving the mind time to acknowledge that difference between the tension and the relaxation. We move to the belly area now. So, so far we have feet, butt, and we're moving to belly. Now this is really the abdominal area and what we do here, it's a two-step process. Earlier, we did a three-step process. This time, when we breathe in, we'll actually expand that belly like we did at the beginning of the session today. And then we'll do the count, and then we'll release. So with our hands still on our belly, exhale completely. Inhale, blow up the belly, hold. Two, three, four, and relax. Relax and let go. If you have eaten lunch or a late dinner, you would skip the belly area. Repeat the second step. Exhale completely. Inhale, blow out the belly. And hold. Two, three, four. And relax. Relax and let go.
allowing that belly area to relax, the entire lower half of the body has now relaxed. We move to the upper parts of the body now. The next logical area to come to are your hands. So bringing your hands up and having a bend right at the elbow there. And we'll be making the fist with the thumbs out when we do this part of the exercise. So exhale completely. Inhale. And tighten. Tighten two, three, four, and quickly release. And let the hands drop. And it's that quick release from very, very, very tight up here to a drop. You can almost hear the sound of the hands dropping. And again, you, you'll feel a little tingly sensation in your fingertips. Again, that's a good, healthy sign. You have an increase in blood flow to your extremities. Exhale. Inhale. And hold. Two, three, four, and release. Release and let go. Pay attention to the sensation in your fingertips. We now come to the shoulders. To prep for the shoulders, We'll take the shoulders, bring them up, and roll them back to make sure that we will be able to bring those shoulders straight up to the ears. Exhale. Inhale. Shoulders up. Two, three, four, and release. Release. Notice the shoulders coming down. Taking a moment. Exhale. Inhale. Shoulders up. Hold. Two, three, four. And relax. Relax and let go. Allow those shoulders to completely and deeply Relax. We carry a lot of weight in those shoulders. So we're giving them permission to rest. Moving now to the neck. In preparation for the actual neck exercise, we're going to roll our neck to allow the release of the tension of the day. We sit at our computers, we drive, we carry so much tension on the neck and the shoulders. There are literally hundreds of little muscles in the neck to allow that gyroscope effect of the movement of the head you know, again, we have this big skull, the heaviest bone we have here in our body. So we'll start by slowly rolling the head to the right. As we inhale and we pause. And then we roll to the left, back toward the center, as we exhale. At the point of reaching the center, you'll continue to the left, inhaling until you go to the full extent of your range of motion, pausing, and returning back toward the center, gentle exhalation, and beginning the inhalation to the right, pausing, exhaling back, to the center. A nice flow right into that inhalation, nice and deep. Pausing, exhaling. This is our last round. 
all the way to the right on your own. And all the way back to your left side. And coming back to center. Now we are ready to do our progressive muscle relaxation of the neck. We call this jutting the jaw, and that's taking that jaw and literally moving it forward. So you're going to move the jaw forward, avoiding the tension to the jaw, just moving the jaw forward. So I'll demonstrate. I'm going to take this jaw and go, and that is where I'll hold it and then releasing it back to its normal position. So we begin, exhale, inhale, and extend that jaw, two, three, four, and relax, relax. Remember to bring that carriage forward and then back, relax, exhale, Inhale, extend the jaw, two, three, four, and relax, relax. Taking your time. Opening the mouth slightly, releasing the tension in the jaw. Moving now to the face, the final stage. Before we do that, we're going to take a gentle yawn. A big yawn would overactivate your brain, but a gentle releasing of the jaw. Drop your jaw open. I like your yawning gently. And then bring it back to a place where it's not completely closed. And just let the Let the jaw rest in a normal, natural position. We bring the attention now to the face. Exhale. Inhale. And tighten. Two, three, four. And relax. So what we're doing is we are scrunching up the face. I call it the scrunchy face. So we'll practice this again when we, after we inhale, we'll scrunch the eyes, the nose, the forehead, and then we'll relax. Okay, so here we go. Exhale, inhale, and scrunch. Two, three, four, and relax. Relax and let go. Nice, gentle breath. We've had a nice journey all the way from the toes to the buttocks to the belly to the hands, the shoulders, the neck, and finally the face. We'll do the face one more time. Exhale. Inhale, and a nice tight scrunch to the face. Two, three, four, and a quick release. Allow it to release and let go. Enjoy this moment.
and allow ourself to be aware of the reduced tension and the increased relaxation of mind and body. We now enter the final phase of our progressive muscle relaxation. It's called the body scan. Bring your attention to your feet. And scan your feet and notice the residual tension that is still in your feet. And begin the process you did before just one time on your own. Exhaling, inhaling, tightening and relaxing. And then I will guide you to the next body area. So begin. Moving up to the buttocks. First scan and pay attention to the tension that remains in that area. This is a way to teach your body where to look for those tense areas. And then begin the release. We skip the belly and move right into the hands and the arms. Next, the shoulders. We don't need to warm up the neck, just moving right into jutting that jaw forward for the neck. For that full body relaxation, we come to the face and we do the face twice, allowing yourself then to just move into a deep, deep state of relaxation and moving right into sleep. Paying attention to the deep state of physical relaxation, mental relaxation. Allowing yourself to drift now to other planes, going to sleep with the suggestion that you will wake up refreshed and ready for the day.